everybody, so welcome to another video. I'm just going to review well, what I saw of the game. Brendan Rodgers first game in charge of Celtic, ended in a 2-2 draw with this Slovenian team, I can't pronounce their name properly, I do apologise. But there were some really, really impressive performances tonight. From what I've seen, Armstrong was fantastic. McGregor was brilliant. The two centre backs, they were both, I think it was O'Connell and somebody else, they were both tremendous at the back for Celtic tonight in that friendly. Chef G did, did a good job. He scored. he done pretty well. Um, Rogic done okay. So, yeah, lots to look forward to for Brendan Rodgers, really. Good, good first game. The draw is not a bad result, considering we were losing 2 0 in the first half. They took a 2 0 lead. And yeah, so the first half, as I said, Celtic were 2 0 down. I think it was a corner, and they scored, and then it was a free kick which they scored from. And then in the second half, Celtic just completely dominated. They had way more possession. They were pressurising every single time the other team got the ball. Celtic would have four players pressurising the man in possession, which was which shows a good attitude, shows that they're willing to play for the team and they're listening to Brendan Rodgers' style of play, which obviously wants Celtic to have dominate possession, but also to pressurise the opposition when they don't have the ball like he did at Swansea. And yeah, in the second half, Rogic got into the box. It might have been like Gerald Rogic, I can't remember who it was. They chipped it across the back post. Chefchi headed it into the net. Goalkeeper got a hand to it, but it was a too strong the header, and it was 2-1. And then Rogic scored a really, really good goal. Armstrong played him in, beautiful ball, and then Rogic chipped the goalkeeper to make it 2-all. And there was other chances, like there was a few headers that went wide, and it was... A really good performance for Celtic in the second half. As I said, it was completely one side in the second half. They didn't really have any... They couldn't get out of their own half. The other team, Celtic, were just pushing them back. And yeah, lots to, lots to look forward to going forwards. The next game that they have is on the 7th of July, I believe. And they play Maribor and Friendly. I know that. From what I've seen, certain players will be leaving. I think Brendan Rodgers... Will be getting rid of some players, for example, like Chef G. Even though he played well tonight, I don't think he'll be there. I think he'll be let go personally. Even though he did play decent tonight, he scored a header, etc. But players like Rogic, McGregor, Armstrong, O'Connell, who keep these guys because they look actually want to play for the team and they have potential. So, yeah, so well done to the boys in Sylvania. Well, well played. It draws a good result. It's better than a defeat, which it looked like was going to happen in the first half, which was disappointed with Brendan Rogers. So you've made him happy by getting a draw. Listen to his philosophy. He's got to continue playing that way and just follow the manager's instructions. He's a good manager and we need to follow the way he wants to play for the qualifying for the Champions League, of course. I'm watching the Portugal versus Poland game now. So I'll review that afterwards. But I just thought I'd review the Celtic game, the friendly as I know a lot of people who watch my videos are Celtic fans. So, yeah, that's just a video for them. So, thanks for, it, for, thanks for listening, guys. Take care, and I'll see you all later on. Until then, peace out.